good morning student of class 8 i am a computer teacher sonji sir hope you all are fine today i am going to discuss some multiple choice question and answer for your first term examination okay and as all of you know that our first term examination is going to start from 9th of august and the first term examination mainly based on mcq question answer that's why in this video i am going to discuss some some multiple choice question and answer okay and this is the syllabus of the first term examination i hope that all of you have already read and learn all this chapter very very carefully and the multiple choice question and answer coming inside from the chapter or from the exercise of the chapter okay so please read each and every chapter very very carefully now move on to the question and answer part so first multiple choice question is which of the following is an example of application software okay which of the following is an example of application software the options are uh, option number one windows option number two linux option number three oracle and option number four ms dos okay so uh, from this following option number three is the correct answer okay oracle is the correct answer oracle is an application software and windows linux and ms dos are example of uh, system software okay so option number three is the correct answer of question number one next is number two which of the following is an example of single user operating system okay single user operating system so options are windows option number two linux option number uh, three unix and option number four ms dos okay uh, so from this following uh, following option ms dos is the correct answer okay ms dos is the single user operating system and also uh, uh, cy based operating system okay ms dos is the correct answer next is number three ms dos developed by microsoft in dash okay so which year ms dos developed by the microsoft uh, company so options are in 1980 in 1981 in 1982 and 1983 okay so uh, in 1981 okay in 1981 microsoft company developed ms or ms dos operating system okay in 1981 is the correct answer and next is number four this is very very easy question which of the following shortcut key is used to create a excel chart automatically okay options are f5 option number 2 f7 option number 3 f9 option number 4 f11 okay so f11 is the correct answer okay we when you press f11 the excel uh, excel automatically create a new chart okay so f11 is the shortcut key next is Question number five: The relational operators are used to compare dash values. Okay, the relational operators are used to compare dash values. Options are option number one, two; option number th uh, two, three; option number three, four; and last is none of these. Okay, so uh, option number one is the correct answer. The relational operators are used to compare two values. Okay, two values. Next is question number six which of the following is refers to the all object of excel chart okay which of the following refers to the all objects okay all objects of excel charts options are option number one chart title option number two chart area option number three plot area and option number four legend so uh, from this following uh, option number two is the correct answer okay chart area chart area refers to all object of the excel chart okay option number two is the correct answer next is number seven which of the following excel chart is used to compare trends in data at equal intervals so options are column chart line chart pie chart dogan chart okay so from this following uh, line chart is the correct answer okay line chart is the correct answer line chart is used to compare trends in data at equal intervals okay next is this question is very very easy okay 
what is the extension of microsoft excel 2016 what is the extension of microsoft excel 2016 options are first option is dot excel sx option number two dot xl xs and option number three dot xxls and last is none of this okay so as all of you know the extension of microsoft excel is dot xl sx okay this is the correct answer of question number eight next is question number nine which of the following which of the following option is used to connect one part of a flowchart to another which of the following option is used to connect uh, one part of a flowchart to another part okay options are first is arrows next is process next is decision box and last is connector okay so from this following connector is the correct answer okay used to connect connector is the correct answer uh, connector is used to connect one part of a flowchart to another part okay next is number uh, 10 which of the following is an characteristics of an algorithm first is input next is output third is uniqueness and last is all of this okay so from this following option number one two and three all are the uh, features of an algorithm okay so option number uh, four is the correct answer all of this is the correct answer of question number 10 okay <coughs> all of this is the correct answer next is question number 11 which of the following is not an example of multitasking operating system okay multitasking operating system not an example of multitasking operating system so options are unix linux option number three windows and os2 okay so uh, from this following uh, option number four is the correct answer os oblique 2 is not an example of micro uh, multitasking operating system okay unix linux and windows are all example of uh, multitasking operating system okay so option number four is the correct answer of question number 11 next is which of the following excel function returns the smallest value in given range okay uh, excel function returns the smallest value in given range so options are average next is maximum next is minimum and last is none of this okay so from this following uh, option number three is the correct answer okay option number minimum function minimum function returns the uh, smallest value in given range okay minimum uh, smallest value okay so minimum is the correct answer so i hope that all of you understand the concept of uh, multiple choice question and answer and all of you have to write this question and answer on your computer copy okay please write this question and answer on your computer copy and all of you have to read each and every chapter very very carefully for this type of multiple choice question and answer okay please read the book very very carefully so today i am ending my discussion here in my next video i will discuss some more mcq question answer okay so till then take care goodbye and thank you